Today I'm coming here to pick up a few things at one of this area's hypermercati or hypermarkets, what we call in America a mega mart. This one is called Hyper Tosano. My name is Linda and I am coming to you today from Vicenza, Italy, where I'm about to take you grocery shopping with me. Iper Mercati, such as Iper Tosano, are so huge. The only practical place they can be built are on the outskirts of town, which is where we are now. I'm looking forward to coming here today because there's a few products and cooking ingredients that I can't find in the U.S. that I hope to find here. Fungi piopini. The common name for these is velvet piopini or black poplar mushrooms. I've never seen them sold at a grocery store in the States and I've been wanting to try these. They're supposed to be good in risotto or in pasta con fungi. I am going to cook these up tonight. We're in the Biere del Mondo aisle, beers of the world. Hollanda e Belgio, that's Holland and Belgium beer selections. Irlanda e Scotia, the Irish and Scottish selection of fine beers. Francia e Inglaterra, that's France and England. America España, that's the Americas, and Spain, oh my god, Sierra Nevada. Over here, let's see, there are some Italian brands, Icnusa is Sardinia, I've tried that one before. Oh, the Peroni is on sale, and it's another really popular brand. And look, you can get them in packs of three. That's great if you have a small fridge. Poretti is another really popular brand in Italy. I love this stuff. I can never find it in the States. Gingerino is a non-alcoholic aperitif that tastes like bitter citrus and ginger and spices and happiness. And look at how cute those tiny little bottles are. I'm looking for something I can drizzle over ice cream or cake. Uh, not something fruity. I need something chocolatey or coffee. Ooh, Janduya. Hello. Crema di cioccolato Janduya. Oh, this is that creamy Janduya hazelnut chocolate. I think I'm going to buy it. <gasps> Pistacchio Rosanas. Oh, I love these. Oh wait, do I want the pistachio or do I want the original? There's also chocolate. One of the baking ingredients I need is pistachio cream. Let's see, there's smooth, there's crunchy, and there's some with chocolate, but I think if I want chocolate in it, that's something I can add myself later anyway, so I think I'm going to choose the plain smooth pistachio cream. And I'll have more options with how to use it that way. I need some vanilla bean.
beans. Here they are. They are eight and a half euro for a pack of two pods, which is a bargain for me, because back in the States, vanilla beans are mad expensive. The last time I bought them, I paid like $20 in America for the same amount. Next thing I need from this aisle are some gelatin leaves. There they are. Gelatina in fogni. It says it's ideal for panna cotta, aspic, Bavarian creams, mousse cream, and gelatin salads. I've never ever seen these sold in an American grocery store. I'm going to stock up on these. Now I need something for breakfast. Fiocchi di avena. Those are oats. Fiocchi di farro di coco. Um, I, I don't know what that is. <laughs> Offerta speciale. Special offer. Vitalis il muesli crocante, crunchy muesli, mix di frutta con uvetta, mertili rossi e mele, fruit mix with raisins, cranberries, and apples. It's a small box, though. Let's see what else they have. Muesli and fruits, crunchy. Oh, this is a much better deal than that other one. 750 grams for two and a quarter euro. I need some cookies or biscotti or something to serve with coffee. Cantucci d'Abruzzo, pistacchi e cedro, pistachio and citron, con zucchero di canna with cane sugar, senza olio di palma without palm oil. I need to get some bouillon and I specifically need porcini mushroom bouillon. These are the daddy or the cubes. I think I'll get a couple of those. This is Bauer Porcini. That one is a powder. Do I want cubes or powder? Hmm. I've never used Bauer before, but I have used Knorr. Oh, I've also used Star. Powder or cubes? Cubes. Glassa al eccetto balsamico is balsamic glaze, and we are fresh out of it. Fiocchi di sale marino affumicato di cipro, smoked sea salt flakes of cypress.
sale aromatizzato di porcini porcini salt This would be the deli neighborhood of the store. Cold cuts and cheeses. Thank you for coming with me. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll say goodbye to you just as soon as I do this one last thing. Ciao for now.